Now, Jimmy, network switches, not the most rock and roll thing in the world, but I no. think what we have here in the Luminex GigaCore 16 RFO is the most rock and roll network switch I have ever seen. It may well be. Mm. Um, look, what we've got here is actually a pair of switches and we've got them linked together with this big roll of fibre. Mm. Uh, the idea of these basically is to make networking a doable thing mm. for people like me who understand <laughs> audio and not networking. Yeah, that's what they've really gone for here. So now that we're running everything over our networks, control for lighting, you know, actual audio signal, you know, comms. Video streaming. Video streaming, yeah. What they've built here is a ruggedized tour level switch with dual power supplies that can run gigabit each Ethernet that is easy to set up. You don't have to have Cisco training to yeah, muck about with I setting up VLANs. I think that's the really that's probably mm. the most appealing thing about this. And mm. I actually I tested this with uh, a, a console, and I, I said I want the first X number of ports mm -hmm. in group three or whatever for audio, and I want these ports over here in the same group, mm -hmm. and it generates the VLAN and everything. It does it all. You don't, you don't have to think to about. It. You VLAN just need means. to no. Mm. You just need to say I want these ports Lighting. to connect to these ports. Yeah. I and want these ports for comms and these ports, and then you can link a couple more of these together. And then, just to really top it off, to make it completely different from anything else on the market, you can actually do that off the front panel. Yeah. Yeah. Now try doing that on uh, HP. That's not going to happen. Yeah. Now, now it's got fiber ports and it's got Ethercon mm -hmm. uh, for gigabit uh, Ethernet copper. Obviously, you're going to get a lot further on the fiber. Mm -hmm. um, so if you're interlinking your switches together, I'd. I'd be looking at fibre if you need some distance. The other nice thing is that uh, you can you can shift these ports, you can shift the fibre ports to mm -hmm. the back panel as yep. well. Um, and also uh, it's got its own sort of redundancy built in mm -hmm. as far as the data links go. So you can have, you know, two, two I mean, I even tried it with one fibre and one copper link. Mm -hmm. um, and then I pulled the fibre and it, it automatically falls over onto the copper. Mm. So it, it knows how to to do data redundancy in the linking as well. Yeah, and again, you um, don't need to go in and do you know, no, crazy configuration. Look, I think this is a, a good product. I mean, it's certainly, it comes at a premium, but I, I think the time you save mm -hmm. in, in your setup costs and potentially the embarrassment you save. Oh, yeah, the peace of mind. When, yeah. you know, some cruddy little RJ45 connected tab mm -hmm. falls off and you main link for your lighting control or whatever comes out you know that's not going to be an issue with this because it's built with people like us in mind yeah yeah this is and basically it's a, very a, it's a network switch wearing a black t-shirt and an all access access all areas pass yeah yep. agreed okay thanks for watching uh if you liked it please like us and uh tell your friends